Hey everybody, I'm here today to show you how to adjust the car seat straps on a Diono Radian RXT car seat. As you can see right here, this is actually the back of a Diono Radian RXT car seat. And essentially I'm gonna show you how to adjust the straps. Now these are the straps right here, okay? Now it's very important to consult the owner's manual to make sure that your car seat is the exact same as this car seat, okay? Even if it is an RXT, it might be a little bit older, a little bit newer, make sure that this is the correct way for your car seat. Also, make sure that you are 100% comfortable doing this because remember, it is the safety we're talking about here. These straps are what protect the child. So it's very important to make sure you're absolutely comfortable doing this. Now essentially, as you can see, I'm pulling on, this is the back of the car seat. I'm pulling on the straps over here, okay, on the Diono Radiant RXT. Um, I'm pulling on the back. I'm so, I actually just want to make sure that I'm saying the name right. I, I'm, like in the back of my head, I know it's called an RXT, but I have another one on the other side. Yep, Radiant RXT, correct. Just want to make sure I'm not giving you any misinformation. Okay, so as you can see, I'm pulling on the front of the straps in the back. And as you can see, this little hook is what holds them in place. Now, it's very interesting because you hook them in there and then they actually get double hooked in there. I'll show you what I mean. So if you want to adjust the height of the car seat straps, what you want to do is you want to slide them out of this hook. Now, in order to do that, you're going to have to slide them sort of like opposite and then out. So I'm not going straight out. I'm going in a bit and then out so check this out i'm going to take the one that is sort of already available to me i'm going to slide it in the hook and then out just like that so as you can see i've removed one of the straps okay now i recommend doing these one at a time so i would take this strap that i removed i'm going to pull it through the car seat and i'm going to go one lower so i'm literally pulling it towards the front and then I'm just literally doing the exact same thing. I'm not flipping or twisting. You wanna keep the strap oriented in the same way. And I'm sending it through this one right here, which is one lower. As you can see, right over here, I just sent it through the lower one. I'm gonna leave that hanging just for now. Then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get the other car seat strap. I'm gonna slide it in and then out. Okay, I've now taken the second one. I'm gonna pull it through towards the front of the car seat keep it in the same orientation and slide it out through the one that's one lower. Now you can do this to raise or lower, it's up to you. So now I have both of the car seat straps again. Now what you wanna do, okay, is you wanna make sure that you are going to be installing them correctly. So as you can see right here, we have a hook, like I said, you wanna slide them into the hook and then make sure that they're hooked in properly, that they're not gonna go anywhere. So you're sliding them into the hook and in this little slot right here. So I'm gonna take one, I'm gonna slide it. Hopefully you can see this properly on camera. I'm doing my best here. I'm gonna slide it into the hook and then I'm gonna get this end and this is what secures it, just like that. So I'm sliding it into the slot here. That is, and pull on it, make sure. That's absolutely secure. I'm gonna take the other car seat strap um, as well. Okay, actually, so take a look. I, you should not do this. What I did is it actually twisted in the process. So I need to take this back out. Make sure that it's not twisted. As you can see right here, if I pull on this, it's twisted. It's not right. Okay. It can't be twisted. So I'm going to take this out and redo it. So I'm going to take this out. Okay. Now make sure it's nice and flat. Okay. Make sure that the belt is nice and flat. I'm usually, I wouldn't have this trouble, but I'm trying to film and talk and demonstrate all at the same time. So I'm going to slide it in like that. Make sure that it's nice and straight which it is, excellent. Do the same thing with the other car seat strap, make sure that's oriented properly. You wanna essentially slide it in, okay? And slide it into the hook, like that. Make sure that it's hooked in properly. So make sure that it's absolutely, you really, like, you really wanna check this? I, I like check it like five times. I'll show you what it looks like. Looks like that right now. So both of these are slid into place properly, okay? As you can see, if I pull on them, as you can see, they're both inside of the slotted area, okay? And if I pull on them at the front, they are absolutely secure. That is a key factor, they're absolutely secure, okay? If you pull on them at the front, you wanna make sure that they're not gonna go anywhere. Make sure they're hooked in properly in that slot. And like I said, please, please, please consult the owner's manual, take a look, make sure that your process is the same as this process. And when you tighten it up nicely like that, when the child is restrained nicely, as you can see, it's nice, the, the straps are nice and flat. That's it. Okay, that is essentially how to adjust the car seat straps to raise them or lower them on a Diono Radian RXT car seat. 
If you like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below as a comment. And of course, be sure to subscribe for more great videos just like this one. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.